All Red Lake students were out of school after a water outage has left most of the Red Lake Nation at a standstill. Our Brenda Mack spoke to residents to find out more. Me and my dad knew something would be wrong whenever <clears throat> our bus didn't come in. So. Schools closed, businesses shut. I uh, didn't even go to work. An overnight water outage has left the Red Lake area with no choice but to shut down. There's no water at home either. It became a ghost town. All government buildings were also left empty. City officials say a main water line in Redby broke sometime last night. There was the text message that was sending, sent out about boiling water. The Red Lake police department sent out an advisory telling residents to boil their water before drinking. The water was a brownish color. Due to discoloration and bacteria concerns, the precaution remains until the sanitation department receives test results. We're seeing faces that we've never seen here before. The shortage has also left residents flocking to the Red Bee area. We had our water out here at one stop, but it came back on like a couple hours ago. And ever since then, we had a lot of business and we sold a lot of gallons of water. Residents say a water outage is not common in the area. The first time it's happened this, this year, but it doesn't happen much. Great. Now what we do know is city workers are working all day today to restore water. And hopefully by tomorrow, doors will be open once again. In Red Lake, Brenna Mack, Lakeland News. The sanitation department expects water to be back up later tonight. The school district has also removed its school cancellation notice from its website just hours ago. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.